Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Photoshop 2022 tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to take any image, like this one here, and turn it into a painting using realistic brush strokes. And not only am I going to show you that, I'm going to show you how to do it based on a reference artist or a reference image. So this is a really cool technique and I think it's the best way to make photos into paintings. I'm going to delete this layer, we're going to start from scratch. Here we go, I've got an image here of this gentleman here, it looks great. And I want to turn it into a um, painting. How do I do it? I go up top here, I go to filter, and then I go to neural filters. It's a new thing inside Adobe Photoshop 2022, I believe. It's, well, it was in the last one, but I know it's in this one, of course, for sure. So what we're looking for is a filter, a neural filter called style transfer. We want to click on that, and then we want to toggle it on. When we do that, you're going to see a bunch of things here. I've already gone ahead and downloaded a bunch of them, and you can use them and use them as, you know, as potential options. But in order to do this the best way, in my opinion, what you want to do now is you want to left click on custom up here. And what we get the option to do is select an image. This is the reference image. This is the painting that we want it to look like. So I've got a painting by Vermeer. I'm going to left click here on this little button. And then you'll see here that when I bring it in, I've got, yeah, girl with a pearl earring by uh, Johann Vermeer from 1665. This is the reference image that I want to use. This is the painting style that I want it to look like. When I hit that button, you'll see that some effects here have been applied, but it hasn't done a great job because it's gone a little over the top with some of the colors and stuff like that. So now I'm just gonna dial it in. I'm gonna drop this style opacity down to about 54%. And again, this is being calculated, I believe in the Creative Cloud. So it's using the Adobe server, so if it's slow, don't panic, it's 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 pretty heavy duty. I'm gonna drop the detail down a little bit. Okay, that's looking pretty good to me. Maybe do we want the strength up a bit or down? What do you think? Let's go a little higher just so I can really sell you on the effect. And then I'm gonna black background blur a bit here. I want the outsides to be blurry so that he is more in focus. So the foreground's in focus. All right, other than that, I'll just quickly do one or two more things. I'm gonna increase the brightness. I want this to be a bit of a brighter picture. That looks a bit too much. And then, yeah, because it's a painting, well, it's saturated a little bit. There we go. This looks great. I'm going to left click on OK here. And now watch. We went from this, which is, our, which is our picture, to this painting that has a similar style to the uh, reference image, which is the girl with a pearl earring. That's all there is to it, guys. This is the best way to do it, I think, in Photoshop 2022. Thanks for watching. Ton more stuff coming up. Stay tuned.